So I just came through the city of Toronto through Mississauga and there was not a flake of snow to be seen anywhere. And uh, within 10 minutes of driving on Highway 400 northbound, I uh, came across uh, flakes and snow on the ground and it actually does look like winter. And as you go further north, uh, you get into a little bit of winter wonderland. I can tell you right now that uh, we've got about 10 crashes. Uh, on the go uh, in the Toronto area and the GTA and central region up towards uh, the north end of the city. But I'll tell you, every single one of those crashes appears to be in an area where there's snow on the ground. So when you see that snow, slow down and uh, and drive according to those conditions. It, ch it changes rapidly. As soon as I got past, let's say, Teston Road on the 400, all of a sudden I saw uh, snow on the ground. It, it's been blowing, uh, a little, a few flakes flying here and there not a major system but it could be just that difference between uh, getting yourself into trouble and uh, making it safely so uh, do your part make sure you're driving uh, slowly and giving yourself a, enough following distance uh, turn your headlights to the full-on position it just gives everybody a little bit of a better advantage to see you if there is snow that's kind of blowing up from uh, behind your vehicle and uh, if you are driving, stay to the right. If you're passing, you pass on the left. If you're driving, you're driving on the right. Speed limit through uh, many areas here is 80. It's a construction zone, so be aware of that. Uh, we have officers patrolling the highways, making sure uh, those uh, laws are being uh, obeyed and uh, adhered. Uh, again, the slower you're driving, uh, the safer and the more time you're going to have to react to any issues around you. Um, I did get some sleep last night, but we had our Heavy Rescue 401 uh, premiere last night. We did a Facebook Live with uh, uh, the guys from Preferred Towing and uh, executive producer of Heavy Rescue, uh, Mark Miller. So that was a ton of fun. And uh, yeah, do you know what? Use your traction control. Use your, you know, those are all features on your vehicles. But if you're having to get into uh, using those features, uh, you're probably going too fast because now your vehicle is compensating for physics that it's trying to slow you down. It's trying to get, regain control of your vehicle. So uh, yeah, your traction control will will kick in. We'll try to do its best. Your tires, if you have winter tires, uh, it'll give you that little extra bit of traction. But again, there's only so much that it uh, is capable of doing. And uh, if you have to slam on the brakes or make a very aggressive uh, lane change steering maneuver to avoid uh, a situation in front of you, that could be um, uh, the problem. And yeah, GTA, yeah, you know, and that's why I use that hashtag. So if you are a Grand Theft Auto kind of guy or girl, uh, hopefully you're also getting a few road safety messages when you're checking out that hashtag. Um, we are hiring, so come on up and patrol. This is what we're dealing with here right now. This is my world, and uh, you can see Highway 400 is moving along. Not too bad. Some of the side roads here as well. I'm just at an overpass here with, uh, you can see snow on the, on the shoulders and through the lanes, and those roads could be a lot slicker. And you got to be careful out there. Snow on the ground, snow in the air, and, and yet today really isn't even... Today isn't even a, a, a winter weather a snow storm day, although I know there is snow coming down further north as you get up towards Barrie and to Aurelia and central Ontario. They've had a ton of, of snow. So if uh, you are traveling at all in your days, make sure uh, you uh, are keeping uh, a close eye on how those conditions can change. And uh, those on-ramps and off-ramps, you come uh, booking around an off-ramp with an advisory speed limit and you don't realize that these roads are wet and damp. Uh, temperature is actually pretty decent right now, uh, although my thermometer is just showing minus one right now. So we are in those in that freezing uh, condition that uh, can certainly cause icing. So thank you, appreciate that. Uh, you can check out my Facebook page. We uh, posted that live uh, after, sh after show uh, from Heavy Rescue and you can talk to uh, or ask questions. I'm gonna get on there later on and, and respond to as many questions as I can. And uh, we're, um, yeah, it's coming down Pickering. All right, do you know what? That east end of the GTA often gets hit as well. Don't know why, but uh, that's what it is. And, uh, and Alex in North York, do you have any snow in, in North York? Because where I came from, I didn't see anything. So um, I know there's uh, winter in different areas, but a little bit right here, but not in, uh, in Toronto, Mississauga, where I just came through. Nothing in Brampton either, appreciate that. Uh, so enjoy that. 
no uh, winter wonderland. It is January. Enjoy it. Hopefully it's uh, refreshing and encouraging. Don't get the blues. And uh, stay a NYPD Brothers in Blue. Awesome. Thanks, man. And uh, you check that wind. Uh, they're talking about snow squalls, and, and we could get some lake effect snow coming up in the next little while out towards uh, uh, western Ontario. I was talking to Gary and Colin uh, uh, Vander Hoogle from uh, Preferred Towing yesterday, and they were th talking there might be some snow coming up towards western Ontario as well throughout the week. So um, that's it. You need some snow. I know the slopes are open, they're making snow, but uh, we're trying to get rid of it on the highways. Uh, have yourself a great afternoon, great day, great morning. If you are driving, drive safe. Keep the rubber side down, shiny side up, and we'll be in touch soon. Take care, everybody.